<coughs> greetings. It is Tuesday, March 31st, 2020. I hadn't planned on uh, doing a short video of these two side by side, but um, I had to move the uh, most recent mosaic drawing combo that was in front of this one, recent, aside from this newest new, new one, uh, to make way for being able to store and store this one in front of that one. Gets uh, plastic covered and, and uh, bungee cords and so on, just in case there's another quake here in Seattle. And I moved the uh, prior most recent mosaic drawing combo uh, sandwich in there between some other others. That's uh, Sightseeing with Dignity 12 uh, El Materio de Rodrigo Rojas de Chile The Martyrdom of Rodrigo Rojas of Chile, 1988 So, um, and I noticed that the, uh, the, uh, had the cover of this one, Under the Wing 66 which I did in 2018 backwards, it said um, back, so I had to pull the cover up to reverse it. And I thought, well, as long as I have it uncovered, I might as well uh, do these uh, two works side by side. So on the left, under the wing 66, the sea monsters and the child with the bird's nest scarf in the Kielce ghetto, Nazi occupied Poland, 1942. Mosaic drawing combo we did in 2018. So there's a drawing in the center, sealed in under plexiglass. Ink, gouache, colored pencil. Sea monsters. on the uh, left and right and then this newest one just completed yesterday actually after I got it up here I was able to see more grout that I hadn't seen when it was lying on my work table here so just spent uh, 45 minutes cleaning off some more grout for example from the <clears throat> that was ended up on the top of the frames so we've got <clears throat> four drawings and three sea monsters this is called the uh, the Sea Monsters and the Martyrdom of Stephen Tyrone Johns, June 10th, 2009. He was a uh, U.S. Uh, federal police officer, African-American, born in 1969, murdered by a uh, Christian-American terrorist at the entryway of the United States Memorial Holocaust Museum in Washington, D.C. This drawing, which has, you can see, three children's children's heads there, and part of the head, like the mouth of one child there, drawn from a Warsaw Ghetto photograph, as was this child, this girl here, drawn from a Warsaw Ghetto photograph. The uh, imagery on the left side of the drawing, drawn from uh, color, Photographic plates of the Colonymous Bible from a book I bought uh, in Jerusalem in, uh, some years back on a teaching trip to Israel. Drawing on the right there of a uh, Romani boy uh, from a photograph taken in the 1930s, which I saw on the website of the photo archives online in the, of the U.S. Holocaust Museum's website. All right. Sea monsters. I, uh, one of the last things I did was this brick, piece of brick, this stone here, and where's the other one? This one here from uh, a walk I did. Uh, I went down from the bank, like to the river. It was like kind of. I guess low tide, and I was out walking along the uh, Thames River one day and picked up these uh, like stones in the brick and the uh, kind of in the mud there. This uh, is from a uh, 
believe it was my memory has from a sewing machine uh, that I uh, from uh, Scotland that I helped uh, an English friend who lives in Scotland uh, moved some stuff to a recycling center near Danoon when I was on a teaching visit to Scotland and uh, I saved some uh, things like that and it ended up here. The British did a great job in 1939 aside from you know, there being allies in the fight against the Nazis and fascists throughout the war. They uh, they took in, I think it was 288 German Jewish refugees from the sailing ship St. Louis in 1939 after it returned to uh, Antwerp, Belgium, having left Hamburg, Germany earlier. Uh, the Cubans took in, I forget, um, close to 30 refugees. The Americans and Canadians took none. All of the uh, refugees that the British accepted were uh, alive at war's end. Of those that uh, ended up in France, Belgium, and so on, a uh, sizable number of them perished in the uh, Nazi death camps. Anyway, a posthumous thanks to the uh, British government of 1939 for their good work. All right, there you have it, sea monsters and victims of genocidal hate, which sadly uh, continues on all these years later um, worldwide, uh, including in the United States, where uh, every Republican who embraces and supports President Trump is embracing murder of uh, African Americans and Jewish people, Hispanics, Muslim Americans and others. Uh, President Trump has steadfastly refused to apologize for his all the years of his Ku Klux Klan embraced birther, birther race aid campaign against African Americans. He's refused to apologize for his virulently anti-Semitic 2016 campaign tweet portraying a photograph of Mrs. Clinton with money and a star of David. And his, uh, his uh, reckless and hateful words about immigrants, Mexicans, for example, led to um, mass shooting terrorism attacks uh, at synagogues in San Diego and in Pittsburgh. Uh, uh, Louisville, uh, where two uh, seniors, African Americans, were, uh, were were shot to death the same weekend as the um, Pittsburgh synagogue shootings, and then there was the uh, mass shooting terrorism attack targeting Mexicans outside a uh, Walmart. Uh, uh, what was that? In El Paso. All, uh, all inspired by uh, President Trump and his uh, hateful uh, rhetoric. All right, that's it for now. Everyone stay healthy and safe with the uh, coronavirus.